Hello everyone, I'm fan of Thomas31, and welcome to the 100k animated Q&A. Okay, questions. Who is your favorite character from Thomas and Friends? In the past, I've said Fergus is my favorite character. Well, that answer is no longer valid. After seeing more characters in action, I've come to like them better. Characters like Hector, or more notably Hero, who takes the spot of my favorite character now. I like Hero mainly because he's a Japanese train of Japanese origin, and you all know how much I like Japanese trains. What got you into the Thomas animations you do? Now that's a story. You see, my first exposure to MMD, the animation software I use, were these Thomas music videos using physically calculated models running on Tomy Track. I was rather young at the time, never considering animation myself. Then, a few years later, I discovered the Neon Tune channel and his The Railways of Cartoonia series. I can't remember if my first video of his was the Meet the Cartoonians Thomas episode or his We Make a Team Together music video. Anyway, at this point, I still hadn't considered animation for myself. Then, sometime later, I discovered Milan's Crotunia Discord server, which I joined. The server had many different people, including a few other animators. I was impressed by their work, and one day I said out loud, I wonder if I should try MMD. And that's when I met a guy named Leon Armas. Leon showed me where to get MMD and all the basics that got me started. And I just went from there. I actually ended up animating for one of Leon's videos. As time went on, I never stopped using the software, and I picked up more and more tidbits until I reached what you're seeing right now. And that's the story, I guess. Why did you not get a Tommy Oliver? Have you seen how much people want for him online? I thought this question would be pretty self-explanatory. Have you ever played a Sonic game? If you have, have you beaten it? The first game I remember beating was the 3DS port of the original Sega Genesis game, both with and without the Chaos Emeralds. I also beat the games on the Sonic Classic Collection DS game, excluding the Knuckles variations. I also completed the bad run of the Sonic 2 Game Gear game on my 3DS. I've played several other Sonic games, but those are the only ones I've actually beaten. When will the 11th episode of Thomas and his Die Pet Friends come out? I don't know. I still need to come up with an idea for the episode first. When did you start your YouTube channel? I created my original channel on October 23rd, 2016 at approximately 1.30pm. According to my About tab, my current channel was created on June 4th, 2017. Now the join date isn't always accurate on About tabs, but I'll trust this one as I opened my channel the same day I created its associated Google account. What was your first Thomas item? I can't say for sure as I got my first item many years ago, but I like to think it was either my Thomas's Sodor Celebration DVD or the Tommy Thomas Ultimate set. What got you into Thomas in the first place? This happened many years ago too, but I think it involved a DVD as my earliest Thomas memory involves me at my grandmother's house watching James Learns a Lesson and other Thomas adventures. What was your hardest Thomas product to find? Hmm... The only thing that comes to mind is my Tommy Murdoch, which I was only able to get because a guy I went to school with was selling off his Thomas collection. Why did you delete your old channel? I didn't. It deleted itself. Originally, I thought my admins deleted it because it was on a school account which was no longer needed as I'm no longer in school. But recently, I read somewhere that YouTube had an update where pre-existing school accounts were deleted and new ones could no longer be created. Have you ever killed a fish? Uh, no? When is season 8 in a nutshell? To be honest, I really don't know. Which series of Thomas and Friends do you like most? Rowey series, model, or CGI? I'd go with model series, because you can't beat the early hit era. Which official map of the island of Sodor do you like best? The Big World Big Adventures map, 
but only because it's a revised version of the map seen in the Blue Mountain Mystery Standard Gauge and Narrow Gauge bonus video. What's the most expensive Tomy model you own? Probably my three white tankers, which all cost me $50. In hindsight, they probably weren't worth it, but I have them now, so that's that. Does your Bachman, Thomas, and Oliver work and run? I bought my Oliver brand new a couple years ago, so he works pretty well. My second Thomas can still run, but one of the bolts for his side rod broke, so his wheels tend to lock up quite a bit. My first Thomas? Well, as you can see, he's long gone. What are your three favorite play rail engines? In chronological order, Oigoa Railway Thomas, C62 number two, and C57 number one. What is your favorite Thomas movie and why? Blue Mountain Mystery. This movie has a nice cinematic appeal that sets it apart from the other Thomas films. The unique compositions along with all the action and mystery really make it stand out, but there's not too much of it, so it still meets the standards of a normal Thomas movie. The animation is also on par with all the good stuff we saw from Nitrogen's time, if not better. And most of all, this movie just so happened to come out the same day my cat was born. Heard of Ben? Of course, I own two toys of him, excluding all the minis. Do you like Amtrak? Yeah, Amtrak's alright.